What is up, Pokemon family? So today I'm gonna be opening up Pokemon Astral Radiance. Got four packs of this. And I am also going to be opening up a uh, collector's box of Shining Fates, the Elder Goss V box. Um, it comes with a oversized promo card and a regular sized V promo card, as well as comes with five packs of, yep, you guessed it guys, you guessed it, give me one second, let me adjust myself here, let me grab these packs and adjust them, and five packs of Shining Fates. So, what we are going to do is, we are not looking, correct, I'm looking straight at the camera, and I am mixing these up so we can open up uh you know all these packs randomly so you know what i mean we can we can get to it oh let me see wow <laughs> how crazy oh well it's okay guys so let's go ahead and open these up let me go ahead and get my handy dandy sleeves and my handy dandy card savers just in case we pull something very dope you know, put that there, put those there. We're gonna start off with the Hisui and Decidueye from Legends of Arceus. This is the, like I said, Astral Radiance pack from Sword and Shield. So, we're gonna go ahead and get things kicked off with this pack. All right, so, code card right there for you guys. One, two, three, four to the front. That's a good old pack trick. And we're going to start off with Leaf Energy. Kyleen. Her Ugly. Asleaf. Ponworth. Puccina. Yanma. Drifloon. Sudowoodo. And a Rallet. Followed by a Rare Hisuian card. Non hollow. Now hit out of there. So, also, in the Astral Radiance pack, you can get a Radiant, which is a shiny Pokemon. You get a Radiant Greninja, Halucha, and Heatran, I believe. So, I've already pulled the Halucha and the Greninja. All I need to pull is the code card right there for you guys, is the Heatran. So, let's go ahead and see if we can pull one of those, and if not, a better card. We're going to start off with the Water Energy. Ursaring. Sweet Honey, Cranidos, Pursuing Quillfish, Rowlet, Pursuing Quillfish again, Oshawa, Hoot Hoot, by a Reverse Hollow Gate Jaw Bog, and a Non Hollow Ursaluna. Okay, no hits so far. Now we got the Hisuian Typhlosion art on this Astral Radiance pack. Come on, let's get some. Come on, let's see what we can do. Code card for you guys right there. One, two, three, four. Let's see if we can get a pretty dope card out of here. Normal Energy, Gold Duck, Switch Card, Cricketoon, Scyther, Eevee, Heracross, Manatine, Quillfish, Cleavor followed behind a rare Vespa Queen non hollow. All right, looks like we're jumping into Shining Fates. Like I said, I didn't mix these packs up, as if you can tell. We're going to start with the Corviknight pack art on this Shining Fates pack. Uh, if I could get it open. Come on now. All right. Code card for you guys. Up, oh, it's upside down. Code card for you guys. Ah, uh, sorry guys. My phone is getting on low percent, but there goes a code card for you. And one, two, three, four. Let's see what damage we can do with this pack. We got the Psychic Energy, Teamia Towel, Daiquiri, Tropius. Morpeko, Chuta, Eevee, Horsey, Cagnia, by Zarude, and a Hollow Indeed, Indeedy. 
go ahead and put this deck off to the side. All right, going back into the Astro Radiance right here. Let's see, last pack magic on the Astro Radiance. Let's see what we can do. So, the number one top card up. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Code card for you guys. Scan that QR code, make it easier. So, top card for Astro Radiance is going to be the Macho Alternate Art, starting off with an Electric Energy, Kulava. Dark Patch, Bisharp, Nicket, Pet Lily, Bergmite, Hippotas, Nicket, Bastard on Reverse Hollow, followed by a non hollow Devile. Well, we didn't get no hits in any of the Astral Radiance. Back to Shining Fates. Here goes your Toxtricity pack. So, number one card in here is, of course, the Shiny Charizard V Max which i'm trying to pull a second one just because up oh, code card there sorry kind of ruined it already but oh well okay so normal energy tropius rusted shield rotom more pico naked eevee gossifleur chutel ooh by a shiny squirvet haven't gotten that and a boss's orders which we're gonna go ahead and put this in a sleeve this can go in a binder instead of the top loader i actually have not pulled that card so that is also going to be completing one of my binders boom the charizard pack that's the main card in this set guys main card so let's see all right there is the code card once again for you guys. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. Followed by a dark energy, rusted sword, Luxio, ball guy, coughing, more peco, horsey, spinnerack, rowlet. Ooh, Cinescorch V Max. Look at that, guys. That is a pretty card. That is a really pretty card. Follow behind a Zarude non hollow. But you know what? I have a lot of these cards right here. Actually, this is probably my fourth one that I pulled, but the other ones are inside of a binder. So we can go ahead and put this inside of a top loader just to have it in the top loader. I'm going to put that up here for later. Which, someday here soon, I will probably go through my binder, show you guys what's all included in my binder. I mean, y'all know, y'all followed me on Instagram. Y'all have seen some of them already. Yeah, I'm gonna bite this pack open. Code card for you guys. One, two, three, four. All right. Lightning Energy, Thackeray, Gym Trainer, Floatzel, Weasel, Shinx, Grookey, Trap Inch, Yanma, followed by a Reverse Hollow Dreadnought, and a Yan Mega Non Hollow Rare. Last pack, last pack magic. Let's see if we can pull that Charizard. See if we can pull that Charizard. It's not impossible. It is not impossible. I mean, I've already pulled one, but. You know, let's see if we go ahead and get that other one. I mean, the pull rates for that Charizard is actually really high. So that means it's really hard to pull. There goes a code card for you guys. One, two, three, four. All right, last pack. Last pack magic. Fire energy. That's a good sign. Darchix. Luxio. Team Yell Tower. Shinx. Nicket. Rowlet. Trap Inch. Coughing, ooh, a Glossifer, followed behind a non-hollow Manaphy. Well, no Charizard today. I mean, we did get at least one good card out of there, which is a Cinescorch VMAX. I mean, if you ask me, this is actually a really pretty card. I love the way Pokemon did these VMAX cards. Uh, they just look so sick and also it's shiny as well i mean that's the whole point of this uh set is you get shiny pokemon in there 
Just like I said, I have already pulled this card one too many times. But I'll let y'all guys get a better look at it. Oh my god. These cards always tend to amaze me every time, even if I pull multiple of them. I mean, they're just really, really eye appealing. They're just so appealing to the eye. Which, I mean, centering does not look that bad, honestly. This, this is a good card. It's a really good card. But, thank you guys for watching once more. I will see you in the next one. Bye.